Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to another episode of RB Plays Enigmatica 6. That's right, folks, we're back in our modded world doing all the cool modded things. My name is RB Plays. I am your humble host on this side of the screen. Thanks so much for stopping by. If this is your first time here. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and get notified every time we put new content up on the channel. So uh, last episode, we did uh, we did some stuff with Create, um, and I was having some difficulties with... Um, with the, the whole turning sand into glass using the encased fan. Uh, and then uh, some people came to the rescue. So we've got a, I've, I've already made the changes. Um, there have been, oh, we've got gravel coming. So that'll turn into something. Um, hopefully it'll turn into glass while we're talking about this. But anyway, so some of you made some comments. There are, uh, there are, uh, there are like hopper kind of things that we can get into. Can I find, uh, there are these things, funnels. Funnels? No, that's a valve. Uh, is it a funnel? What's it called? I can't remember what it's called now. Oh, you're gonna, are you gonna be? No, you just went to storage. Oh, well, that's fine. Um, anyway, so in here, in create, there are, yeah, it's a funnel. So you can do a brass funnel and you can do uh, filters with those brass funnels. And basically they'll just, they'll pick up whatever you, whatever you tell them to pick up. But I wanted to do it the conveyor belt way. And so Sonic, one of my longtime followers, longtime supporters, uh, made a comment on the last video and posted some screenshots in our in our Discord and came up with this little gem. I adapted it, of course, to fit my needs. He had everything coming into the back of the storage drawer, but, uh, but I've got it coming into the side just so we can kind of keep everything nice and compact. But anyway, basically what happens here is we've got a lava source block here. We've got a conveyor belt here. We should be getting another piece of sand relatively soon. And the next piece of sand that we get should get turned into glass. But basically this whole process here stays the same. So uh, cobblestone gets turned into gravel over there and then, oh, here it comes right now. So that'll get turned into gravel. It'll take a second for that to happen. It'll follow these conveyors. This one here, I, it might be going to storage. So we'll see, no, it's gonna follow all around. So it's gonna go around and it's gonna drop into these guys here. Uh, once it goes into these guys here, we'll get at least sand if we don't, and we might also get uh, some clay and some flint, um, but that'll get ground up, get turned into sand. The sand will follow all the way along to this conveyor here. As you saw just a minute ago, we've got a storage, uh, a storage drawer over here with a, uh, a dropping conveyor belt on top of it. Um, to collect half of the sand. This one here, oh, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> okay, that was unexpected. That was not supposed to happen like that. Um, um, we might need to, yeah, we might, we might need to do something about that. Um, I've never seen it do that. I've never seen it drop, uh, I've never seen it drop sand into the lava. Uh, but that's okay because we can just do this and we can go like this doop, and so then it will turn it into glass and since the conveyor is pointing into the drawer once it turns into glass it gets sucked into the drawer and so we currently have uh, 254 pieces of glass that's not too shabby it's not great but it's not too shabby there's a way that you can speed all these things up we can either add more uh more frames to the uh, to the windmill to get it to generate more uh su or we can also put gears on this and you get uh, like you get a you get a, a gear system in place to, to ramp up the the rotational speed and make it produce things faster, which would be cool, right? Like it would be super cool if it would produce faster, um, but it's not necessary. Today, what I want to do, I want to take a break from create because my brain is fried from create right now. It's not a problem, right? Create is fun to use, creates fun to work with. Uh, and I'm going to do more with create. I mark my words. But right now we need to just let this thing run so that we can get um, so that we can get all the cobble and sand that we need for uh, for the concrete that we need for our for our wizard tower. But what I want to do today. Yeah, that's storage. What I want to do today is I want to actually get into uh, I want to get into refined storage. I think I think it's time we've got all these little all these little pods, right? We got we got this right here with all these storage drawers, so we could tie into that with a drawer controller. We've got the uh, the greenhouse that we made in the last episode, uh, so we get we've got all the storage drawers that we've put in here. Plus, we can do like a uh, what is it a, a storage bus to tie into these wooden crates as necessary, and the storage room downstairs. Uh, we're gonna need to get access to all of that stuff in one place so that we can make crafting a lot nicer. Um, 
So today what I want to do is I want to get into uh, I want to get into refined storage. Now we're probably going to have to update our power scenario a little bit. I've got some ideas for that, right? What I do want to know from anybody that might be in the know, is there a way to use create to generate more power? If there is, cool. If not, I've got some other ideas as well. Um, we could do some, uh, we could do another immersive, since we've got a kind of a windmill theme here, we could do immersive engineering to get some windmill power. Uh, we also uh, have mechanisms. So we've got these windmills, although they don't necessarily fit the motif that I'm going for. Um, I put that in just as a kind of a, to, to start with kind of a thing, but maybe we do some of those up higher. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, so to get into refined storage, I think the first thing that we need, I think is just a controller, right? So at refined, uh, controller. So to build the controller, what do we need? We need to get some quartz enriched iron. Quartz is not a problem. We need an advanced processor, which shouldn't be a problem. That's a raw advanced alloy. We need some processor binding. Processor binding comes from slimes. Aha. Also though, did I see goo balls? I do have a few of those goo balls. I have oh, those are ember gel balls. Oh, those aren't goo balls. Anyway, there's a way to make uh, there's a way to make slime using uh, using create. So let's go downstairs and let's get, oh, I think I have, I do have what I need. Uh, I think I have everything I need. So if we come out here, if we come out here, we can actually do, uh, we can actually do something, uh, do something right here, actually. So do I have my, I do have, I need my create box. So we'll do the create box right Eh. Right there. Uh, we've got, nope, that's the storage drawers. Why do I not have, yeah. oh, that's the create box. Yeah. That's the store. Okay, so we need that. And we need uh, a couple of other things. We're gonna need some of this. We're gonna need some of, uh, some of these probably. And you, yep, you're turning that way. So if I put a wheel right there, no, 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 not like that. Never like that, breaker, cool, do that and then do that that's better uh then we need to get a if i do that and then that yeah that'll work and then that yeah that's perfect yeah perfect so now if i go up here up top uh what do i got for blocks here we can drop in, and at some point we'll figure out a way to automate this, right? But for right now, what I wanna do is I wanna turn, without grinding myself up, I wanna turn all of this wheat into, into flour, right? Might take a minute, but that'll turn that into flour, and then you mix the flour into dough, and the dough becomes, uh, you can mix the dough with something and it becomes a uh, it becomes a slime ball, right? So if we look up slimes here real quick, slime ball right there. So dough plus lime dye gives me a slime ball, right? So I'm gonna let that, oh, it did the thing, it did the thing. So now we turn wheat flour, wheat flour gets turned into dough with a bucket of water. So that's cool. Let's uh, let's get these back because I don't think I want to leave these here. Boom, boom. Cool. Uh, somewhere around here, I have a toolbox that's going to have water in it. Nope, not there. It's going to be. I've, I'm getting. Oh, I'm trying to get organized, y'all. I'm trying to get or There's tools. Trying to get organized doesn't necessarily work very well. But we got some we got some stuff here to get water. Let's go get some water. Yeah, we got room. You know what I do need? I need a water source close by. We should make that. We should make that up here so that we have a water source up close by because we don't have that yet. We're we're 15 or 16 episodes in. We don't have a source of water. That's a fail, RB. That's definitely a fail. But anyway, we'll get some water. We'll go ahead and fill all of these buckets up. And then uh, up here, we'll create a water source, an infinite water source. Don't know where I want to put that, though. Hmm. I need to look into what I can use to get uh, an infinite water source 
uh, available in my refined storage system. I think there's a new update for thermal expansion or thermal whatever it is now um, that will give us the aqueous accumulator, but I don't know that that's in this pack yet. Uh, aqueous? Aqueous? There's a mob filter for water. There's an aquarium. There's... Nope, it's not in here yet. Uh, but that's fine. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Um, for right now... For right now... I'm just going to put you right here. There's one bucket of water. Another bucket of water. And then refill those two. And then we can go in here and we can do uh, we can do the thing. So slime balls. Again, slime. Nope, slime. And then that. And then that. Yeah. So it's not super efficient, but we'll make it so that it can be. But if we don't have to have a slime farm, boy, that'd be that's the cat's meow, right? Not having to have a slime farm would be great. You know what? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this in here because uh, I should be able to put it right here for the time being. We won't have it stay here forever. Boom, 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 boom. That way we can do all of this at one in one place, right? Do that, do that, do that. All right, and then we can put those up there, that up there, make one of those. And uh, I'm gonna stand here and I'm gonna do this for a little while because there's no good way to do this. Um, yep, I'm gonna stand here and I'm gonna do this for a while. I'll come back to you in just a minute when I have a sufficient number of slime balls that I can make, okay? Okay, so I've got about a half a stack of dough. I'm ready to turn this into uh, ready to turn this into uh, into slime. So we just need to get some lime green. I got lime green flowers up from the uh, up from the greenhouse. So we'll turn that into that. We'll do this like so. We'll do this like so, and that gives us lime green dye, uh, which is cool. It used to give us the 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 lime powder or whatever it was from Botania, but I guess that's not a thing anymore. I mean, it's fine. It's cool. Um, but anyway, we'll put that up there. We'll put that up there. And ta-da, we have a half a stack of slime balls now. How about that? Oops, I don't know what the heck I'm doing here. Give me that. Give me that back. Okay. Anyway, so that gives us that. Now we're going to get into the controller here. So to get into the controller, we're going to need some quartz enriched iron. Quartz enriched iron is super easy. Uh, so let's get a stack. Can I get a stack of, can I get a stack of, uh, of iron here? How much iron do I have? Uh, ooh, I'm going to need to do some iron mining here pretty soon. Absolutely. Uh, so that'll give us a stack and then give me... Uh, well, I don't necessarily need a stack of that. Uh, that's probably good. I don't know how many that is, but it'll be fine. And uh, so we're going to go like this. And we're going to go like this. And that gives us quartz and rich iron. A little over stack. I mean, it's not great, but it's it's a step in the right direction. So they got that. Uh, then we need some, ooh, silicone. Oh, silicone just comes from smelting. We can do that in a redstone furnace. That's cool. How much of that do I have? Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 20. 20? I don't know if that's going to be enough or not. We're going to find out, though. So I'll turn that into uh, into silicon. What else do we need? We need a machine frame or a machine casing. So that's quartz and rich iron around any kind of stone. We should have stone in here. Uh, stone. Yes, please. So let's make that. And that's going to be like that. And then some of this. And there's a machine casing. Cool. Uh, do we have three of these yet? I don't know. Yes, we do. So give me three of those. Uh, and then we need to make, uh, then we need to make this thing. So we need a binding. We need a thing. We need a diamond and a piece of redstone. Okay. So give me a piece of redstone, give me a piece of that, and then 
that's string. I think I have string. I should have a little bit of string. Yeah, I got a little bit of string. String is something that I can do. String is something that I have. So that's going to be... What was that? That's the slime balls. Okay, so slime balls there. You there. That gives us eight of those. That's cool. Uh, I'm going to put slime balls away for right now. Let's get the rest of these pieces of silicon. Not the rest, but some more. I think we're ready to start putting this thing together. Yeah, so we got that. Then we need that. Then we need this. Give me that. Cool. We'll burn that up. <laughs> burn it up. Can I make that in the... I can make it in an energized smelter. Nice. So you can go in there. Cook that up real quick. Give me this, right? Can I cook those? Can I make silicon? I can. So if I take some of those, one of those, and make it, oh, give me, yeah, give me that. If I give, oh, look at that. We made an advanced processor. Uh, so if I give this a home, there. Sure, that'll work. And if I make more, it'll just go into storage, right? Right. I like it. Okay. So now that we've got that, we've got that, we should be ready for this. <gasps> we have a controller. We have a controller, y'all. Refined storage. And I could put that, I think I can put that right here. Yeah. Uh, give me breaker. Yes, please. Oh, yeah, I can definitely put that right there. Mm. So if I put the controller there, it's online. Oh, baby, it's online. It's so good. Now, what do we need next? Probably, probably going to need some kind of, oh, let's see. Ooh, you know what I should do? I should make some cables, and I should make some... Uh, I should make a, a storage, storage bus, storage, external storage, one of these guys. So we need one of those, we need one of those that takes quartz and basic processor is iron. What are these? Just chests, gold, okay. What's it take to make the cables? So the cables are glass, redstone, and refined iron, all right? Because what I can do is I can bring that out of here bring it down, and then right down here. I can put it into the storage, yeah? I can tie it into this, uh, I can tie it into this slave somehow. Yeah? Yeah, I can definitely do that. I'll have to figure out how to get it down there, but Okay, anyway, I'm getting I'm getting distracted. So anyway, we want to make the external storage, which means we need some of these, which means we need a couple of pieces of glass, which we uh which we have outside. <laughs> we'll get we'll go get some glass. We're gonna need an external storage outside on all of that stuff up there, so we'll have to tie all that together too. This process is gonna be complicated, but it's gonna be worth it going to be complicated, but it's going to be worth it. Give me a couple of pieces of glass. There's a creep. Oh, there's a creeper right there. That is the wrong spell. And he's dead. Okay, good. Did he drop anything? He did. All right. Go back downstairs. See if we can come up with some other stuff here. None of this stuff is super complicated to make, right? Like this is just gold. Uh, then there's another. Uh, then there's another diamond, and there's a destruction core, which is a basic and a piece of quartz. So none of this stuff is super complicated to make. If y'all don't mind, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do this off camera, um, just because. I'm trying to make sure that we get enough content in the video that's worth watching, you know? 
I need a piece of redstone. Okay, I'll be back with you guys in a minute. Okay, so lots of progress later. Uh, we've got some basic processors here. Now we just need to cook up the raw improved processor. Uh, while that's cooking up, we can make a couple of things. We need some quartz. Quartz. Uh, I need a piece of quartz. And then what do I need for... So that's this one. Oh, I need glowstone. Uh, glowstone, I think it's down here. Yeah, there's glowstone right there. So we got to make these two uh, annihilation and creation. Annihilation and formation? I think it's annihilation and formation. Construction and destruction. Yeah, it's annihilation and formation in applied energistics. It's construction and destruction here in uh, in uh, in this in this here mod pack here in refined storage. So there's one of those. And then we need uh, one of these. Yes, please. So that's those. Go get that piece of gold. Because that'll make our improved processor. Yes, please. Thank you. Oh, man, we got all kinds of things. Yay. Nice. Uh, okay. So that should give us almost everything we need. We just need a couple of chests. Um, hello? Yeah, okay. Let's uh, just do it this way. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. That'll give us enough to make four chests. Not that we need four chests, but hey, it's fine. All right, so there's that, and then there's that, and that gives us a storage bus, right? So now we can take the storage bus, storage bus, uh, external storage. Got to get used to the names. Got to get used to the names. So we're back here, I've cleaned out a space. I've got my controller right here. Uh, down here, I've got my device controller, drawer controller slave. We can just hook you up just like that. Yeah. And then we can do this. And that should be online now. So, uh, oh, um, is there a, there's configuration. Oh, I can, I can fit in between there. Nice. Uh, there's configuration here. So redstone mode types, uh, blacklist, whitelist, extract mode, or exact mode priority. I think, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I don't know. It doesn't necessarily, I think we can do it like that. Uh, the other thing that we need now is we're going to need a, uh, we're going to need a, uh, 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 a grid, right? I think they're called grids here. Yeah. So just if we just do a regular old grid, uh, so we need an improved processor, a construction core, another improved process. So Im two improved processors. Okay. So I got to cook up some more stuff. So let me go ahead and cook up some more things and, uh, and I'll come back to you guys in just a minute and we'll be able to put this thing online and we should be able to do some cool stuff. Be right back. All right. So Last couple of stages here. We got to make a construction core check. We got to make a, a destruction core. Ooh, I need a piece of quartz. Uh, quartz is over here. Um, everything else is moving along swimmingly. Uh, made the uh, made the basic processors, the improved processors, all that good stuff. So we need one of you check, and then we should have everything we need now to make one of those. Yeah. Nice. Uh, now, do we want to see if we can do a crafting grid? Crafting grid is an advanced processor. We should, yeah, we should totally do that because we're going to want to craft from thing, things from here anyway. So let's do that. Let's get a, uh, let's get a crafting grid. Let's get one of you, one of you. Uh, oh, I'm, do I not have any more of those? <gasps> I don't have any more of those. Oh, no. I need to make some of those. Just need string and slime balls. Okay. So one, one, two, cool, do that, Oop, not like that, like that, like that, like that, uh, nope, that's, that's not, that's not the recipe for that, it's that, there we go, now we can do this, so that, uh, plus, I want the crafting grid, I want this one, yeah, that one, that one, that one, cool, cook that up, uh, where's my, where's my furnace, it's over here. So we'll get that going. And then what else do we need? We just need a crafting table. That's easy enough. A crafting bench. Cool. And one of you. You should be done by now. Yes, you are. And that, as they say, should be that. Sweet. We're making all kinds of achievements here today. Now I can just plop this guy right, 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 right there, online. Look at that. Everything that's in there is now in here. That 
is what I'm talking about. Whew, dudes, that was amazing. We got some cool stuff. Now what I got to do is I got to make more of those storage buses, uh, those, uh, those external storage things. We got to run one out to the create farm for the uh, sand and cobblestone or sand and glass and all that good stuff. We got to run one over to the uh, over to the greenhouse so that we can have access to our uh, botania flowers, other crops and all that. But that'll be for another day, maybe even for a live stream because sadly, I am out of time. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The likes and subscriptions help out oh so immensely when it comes to those pesky YouTube search results. The other thing that helps out a lot is comments. So make sure you leave your comments right down here in the comment section below and we'll chat about it. Leave your tips, your tricks, your pointers, your attaboys, your what in the world were you thinking, all that good stuff, and we'll chat about it in kind. Don't forget to stop by our Discord server where we talk about all things life all things gaming, and all things Minecraft. Also, don't forget that we live stream every two, uh, every Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday over on twitch.tv slash rb underscore plays. The link for that will be right down here in the doobly-doo below, and there'll be a place over there where you can see the times. But once again, folks, that is all the time I have for today. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, we will catch you on the flip side. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.